I suspect this lamp caused the fire. That's what the investigation suggested, too. But does your report mention the bloodstains? The lamp didn't fall, it was thrown at someone. For heaven's sakes, no. The report doesn't mention that. I firmly believe this fire was more than just an accident. Huh. What's your theory? I think the Hawkins couple got into a fight. You sure of that? There's only one way to be sure. I just ask that you don't disturb anything. If Chief West found out about what we're doing, I'd be in serious trouble. These bandages are covered in dried blood. But whose? An original edition of Mary Shelley's Frankenstein. Dated 1818. It's quite a building, don't you think? Do you know that the Hawkins were among the wealthiest families on the island? What do you know about Charles Hawkins' activities? Well, not much, to be honest. We all assumed the Hawkins lived on Charles' inheritance. This place was falling apart long before the fire. This piano is in disrepair. Looks like the Hawkins kept it more for decoration than for music. Hmm. Moby Dick, Melville's classic. The epic battle between man and whale. Mandatory reading for any whaler, I guess.
Dark water history. This place was settled back in 1692 by two families that seceded from the New England colonies. Uh, Greek mythology. Hecate, goddess of the dead, daughter of Tartarus, and mother of Scylla. something disturbing about this painting. Twenty thousand leagues under the sea. Another story about the mysteries of the deep. Crowbar could prove useful. What could Sarah have done to make this person threaten to call the police? Locked. The boys' room. Child's fort. From what threat was Simon protecting his world? Tom Sawyer, Mark Twain. Sarah must have read it to him before bed. Sleeping pills. Strong for an 11 year old boy. What was wrong with this family? What nightmarish vision could have inspired them? Simon's troubles went beyond family problems. That kid saw something. Something terrified him.
What will her room reveal about her? A barbiturate prescription from a certain Dr. Fuller. That's a massive dose. Was Sarah violent? This padlock is too complicated for me. Barbiturates. Sarah Hawkins must have been extremely agitated resorting to such a treatment. Hmm. This door is locked. Was Sarah Hawkins interested in the occult? What was she trying to achieve? This ledger lists all of the paintings Sarah Hawkins sold. It seems the last one was given for free to a Francis Sanders. I wonder why. Despite what happened, they seem to have loved each other.
Sarah Hawkins' agent was getting worried. Seems she wasn't giving any signs of life. The door is blocked on the other side. Bradley? Is that you? Anyone there? Did you see which way he went? Who? I didn't see anyone. I just heard some noise. Are you all right? A man was hiding on the upper level. He ran when he saw me. He can't be far. <sighs> this door is blocked from the outside. I'll cover you. This door was cl closed earlier. Where did he go? Must have got out some way. No, no, he was here. I'm sure. Let's search this room. This globe seems to have been part of some mechanism. Doesn't work. I must have missed something. <laughs> Doesn't work. Seems like this came from a log.
It looks like an old seaway map. Looks like the, the navigational paths described in the log. Looks like the navigational paths described in the log. Why are these letters here, and not with Sarah Hawkins' belongings? Clearly, Charles Hawkins knew Captain Fitzroy very well. I wonder who the man with the glasses is in the photograph. Probably another friend of Hawkins. As if the bookcase has been moved several times. <laughs> Doesn't work. I must have missed some. Looks like it worked. Well done, Pierce. 